Hey there, everyone, the SoCal playing Rayman Legends, and I hope y'all are excited because today's a main game progress day. Those don't happen super often, but here we are. Yeah, 42 out of 10. How many main game levels do I have left to do? One, two, three, four, five. I mean, we'll see what happens today. So we're kind of like in mid-game of the last world. I don't know, this is a Murphy level. You can tell because it's like right there. It's, it's right there, it's on the painting, holding a shield. The Great Lava Pursuit! Today is a day with lava. Look at this great mound. got foreground mounds and everything. All right, right, I don't... I was trying to time my jump like I was playing Donkey Kong Revenge Return. That's funny. So that guy there is gonna give me punch powers. All right. Well, good for you. Well, yeah, love a pursuit. There might be. Yeah. Well, there's a pursuit part. It's Quoster nose. I've never seen that before. Wait, wasn't there Murphy though? Is this gonna be like both? It's not impossible. Like pink flash there. Oh yeah. Okay. So we're doing both. I guess. Oh, you stink so much. Look at that green halo of odor. Alright, well, I mean, right now it looks like it'd be a quick thing, but he's taking his time, clearly. <laughs> like, he's just kind of slowly mentoring into the background. Alright, well, you know what? He's having fun, so it's all good. There we go. Did that cage. It's all night. Oh, thank you for giving me the lift. Thank you for giving me an anti lift. Pop! Bop! Destroy all! Bop. Yeah, that's right. Destroy all. That counts you. All right, that's a ceiling, so I want to do that. Here we go. Ah, whoops, and then I wasn't holding very good, so I fell in the fire and died. Uh, yeah, the, um, the up hits, not super always obvious. I don't know. Well, let's see. So, what? Was I not on the shield? I mean, I guess not. Uh huh, yeah, yep. Yeah. Land! Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so that's number two. Taking a time, not killing that other guy. There's no real reason for it. There you go, destroy you. Just kind of looking around here. Like, yeah, it's a pursuit, or so I'm told. I just, I'm just. It's not. <laughs> like. The reality is you can take the time that you want. It's the music makes it all like scary. But you know, don't let yourself get impressed. You know, it's all good. Yeah, yeah, you're doomed to that guy over there. Then you have time to realize I was there. It's sad. Anything up here? I mean, there could be. There isn't. All right, just putting myself in a danger here. Don't worry about it, it's all good. Yeah, bone structures. All right, so we're gonna go here, and then you got like, uh, okay, that just kind of happened itself, all right? Centurions! Well, and you like hip lights, like, this is Greek, not Roman. All right, so just do that underneath, look at that, all that hot sauce, looking pretty good. All right, yeah, get that thing, there you go, you go here, then we can go up, whoa, look at that. The upward, whoa, what a hidden place. Never before seen area that you can find. All right, so we're going to do some wheel rotations as we go up. All right, so you gotta sh Whoa! Okay! You can just go. All right, remember that. And next time, you're in the soup bowl. All right, so don't go too hard. That should be fine, right? Maybe if I just kind of go in the bottom here or duck a little bit. All right, so here we go. Thing. Okay, I actually, my sense of gravity is absolutely ludicrous. So it's not good. So I'm gonna put that there because I'm gonna run up here. Oh, that's it. You just swing it one way, one way, and then not the other. That's weird. All right. Then you just tie the queen to a stick, not even in a cage. Like they're not taking this queen seriously. The same way I'm not taking the person I'm following right now, allegedly very seriously at all. Whoa there, that momentum. That was pretty wild. Is there something up here? All right, there's foreground, but it doesn't mean anything. Hey, you're being very lazy. 
I wish you would take our pursuit more seriously. Clean that rock. There you go, bud. Oh, gonna kill that man. Well, I was not holding the button to wide. Oh, and then I just took damage, so I could have saved myself, but I don't know. Like, I figured I touched fire, I'm probably just dead. But no, um, well, you know what? Maybe it's better that I keep going with all my health, though. Yeah, see, so what happened is that I just stopped holding, uh, like, I did not press A to enter a glide mode, right? Now you gotta hold it to keep gliding. Huh? There you go, landed on you. Uh-huh, now we're gonna stagger a little bit. There we go, hey, we're here now. Where is here? Right here. Fire! Okay, I heard- no, it's you. You- every time you say something, I keep thinking it's someone asking for help. Uh, th this is the real reason why I don't care much for you sometimes, buddy. Like, I understand how you're trying to help, and you are very helpful. In fact, the game would be impossible without you, but, ah, you just, you mix me up, because you keep having things to say. Okay, there's no win here, so, you know, there we go. Whoa, 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 whoa there, lady, you just... All right, I must have had pressed uh, forward a little bit because you interpreted that as dash attack. Uh, I was not ready for a dash attack. Land, there you go. Now I can do that. Here we go. Then we gotta time ourselves. There you go. Everyone's destroyed. Then I got warped over there. Just grabbed from my shielded stance and just kind of put way over there. As you do, that majestic music happening. I can destroy you like that. Yeah, I, you got my attention, friendo. Don't worry about it. All right, so here, just kind of wait. Got it. Whoop! This shield, not the most solid of uh, platform. Like it's, this has been happening, you know, where like there's no reason for me to fall. I'm on it, but then I stop being on it. All right, it's fine though. Go. Like, it just it feels like I have to take, like, an extra half second just to ensure that, yes, I am standing upon this thing. Whoa, this land is having fun. All right, well, that land is just gone now. All right. Ew, mighty leap, mighty shield swing, look at that. Then we can use things like that, and then we end up here and destroy a pile of bone that someone just left there. How clumsy. All right, yeah, change things up. Pack upward, get those things, go above the wall here, and there's nothing. All right, here we go. Hot sauce delivery. That cage is hot sauce proof. But I'm not too surprised, honestly. Here. Whoa! Okay, I was not looking where my player character was. I was looking around, anticipating the future, and, uh... You know, that's something I do a lot when I play a game I'm very confident with. But, you know, sometimes you, you, gotta, you gotta be careful. Yeah, see, there's like... There is some very silly physics-based liquid physics going on there. And, uh, yeah, I'm hearing a chicken, but no, it turns out it's just that thing. Alright, did it. Solve that puzzle, then you go back up. I mean, these guys are very scary. How do you get you down there? Oh, do you lower that shield? You sure do. You did it! Alright, solve that puzzle. There we go. Hot sauce in the night. Destroy you. Hey, buddy, you're dead. Whoa. Incredible. That's neat. It's scary, but it's super neat. Here we go. Yeah, you are free. Wonder what the version of this that plays on itself, like, what do CPU controlled characters do? I don't know. Hey, look at that. You're waving at me. Uh, it's pedal power, and that's enough. You just point. Yeah, I'm at my stop. Turns out this is just the worst Uber service in the universe. Except you got your place. But then that guy starts to talk skull eventually. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. The skulls, they all got equal eye holes. So it's a, you know, it's a HD 3D skull. Always flaunting their superiority to our regular skull holes, and I, I'm just, you know what? That's how you know these guys are villains, ultimately. And we're gonna go up this tower of living beings created out of light. Uh, pretty wild. Uh, everyone's dancing somewhere, if you don't think about it too hard. Uh, 
That's my job. Everything is green and full of columns. Uh, or at least part of them. <laughs> Cut your column. Uh, that. Everyone's just appearing savagely on the hardwood floor. Incredible. Oh no, there's a skeleton man that lives here. Alright, well, let's do it again with one more skull. Uh, it gets the Great Lava Pursuit. Uh, this time, it's Invader. Then, yeah, it, three to one! There we go! Oh, it's these guys! Uh, oh, that's neat. Like, like, see, like, you call it the Great Lava Escape Invader, but, like, it's a completely new and different level that has, like, nothing to do with the original. I, and I love that. Alright, just kinda go in there. Here, whoop, there we go, I landed on a guy with a spike on his body, and I died! And I died! Uh, where did that guy pop? Right over here. Uh, you're doing too slow, buddy! You're slowing me down! Woo! There we go. Whoa, dodge a guy! Do a jump and then don't fly! What, you didn't? Okay. Yeah, I'm, uh, I think I've been a bit too aggressive. Really? No, again, this good. Okay, there, don't attack, because that happens. <sighs> There's totally a way. Go normally. Mighty jump, mighty jump, mighty jump, then just kind of fall and let it happen. Thank you, Mr. Slime. Well, Mr. Mr. Wiggles. Okay, so there's the irony there. I don't think irony is the correct word, but here's the reality. Like I tr didn't try to do dash jumps, didn't try to do anything special. Just did the platforming normally while running forward and everything was timed perfectly. Sometimes that's all you need to do. And then every time I try to do like, you know, like spin jumps and whatnot to go faster, like that was the result. The result was just that I would get a uh, untimed, like just detimed everywhere. Man, every level gets an invasion, doesn't it? I think that's the lesson here. They're just happening. Yeah, see, we got an invasion. We got one more invasion that popped up. We're not, we're gonna leave it for next time. Cause we got more origins to do right here. Oh, it's a chest runner though. So, well, well let's see how it goes. Slowbox trying to give that chest a high five. Tricky Temple 2, it's the second one. Also means, also, all right, I'm glad we've gone that figured out. Isn't that the last one in the in the real game? Yeah, like that's like the really hard one. Well, let's see how it goes. This game controls better. You can just kind of go. I well, I don't know if it controls better, but I certainly feel a lot more comfortable. I feel like I don't know. Like I don't remember that. Oh wow, I was too fast. All right, there we go. Don't worry about any other cages. Just a bindy jump, and then we just kind of let things happen. Why let it on your head? Oh no! <laughs> that was so well timed. Just a big old bump. I don't know why she wasn't dancing though. She was just frozen in place. Uh, maybe, maybe it turns out landing foot first on a chest is pretty uncomfortable. It's not impossible. Oh man, that just kind of flew, huh? I'd be ready to play some more, but I I feel like oh look at that, it's right into snow. I was about to say rain, and snow is basically rain, just when the sky is colder. All right, I think that's gonna be it for today. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna rub some tickets. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Look at that. Look how backloaded the origin paintings are, though. It's kind of Okay, so that's in world one. Poor little Daisy. I don't know, you know what? I think I'm gonna go and do it. I got a monster, by the way. Incredible, I'm aware. All right, let's do it. You know what? Yeah. I, that barely counted. This, it's the last one. 
Ooh, I'm gonna complete an origin world. Like, what does that mean? I guess we're gonna find out. So it's gonna be the world one boss. Do I remember what it is? It's the plant monster, probably, giving the name. Okay, here's the smiling cube. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's it for you? Okay, you're a Mr. Platform. As you do, get there and get... Yeah, oh yeah, so there's a whole level attached to this. I kind of remember that. There's a uh, royal highness of some kind. There you go. Yeah, you want that attention. Uh, I thought I touched that bubble, which would make something happen, but... Did I... Yeah, there we go. I guess I didn't touch it well enough. You're gonna be like all picky about it. All right, so it's the little gray, uh, gray, red weeds it looks like. Except there it didn't do nothing. All right, now I got some attention. Here we go. Give me that juice. Give me that toast that I will eat in the morning without your nose. That looks like an up uh, block, but like, you know it's not gonna block anything. Yeah, see, there I went. Okay, maybe it's just timed with Daisy's approach. And I just kind of misattributed things. That wouldn't be too big of a surprise. There you go, your kingship. All right, you're gonna risk some of these. You're gonna get this. Then you're gonna get down here and destroy you. Do I wanna destroy these? Whoop, but I, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, punishing. Oh, there we go. So that just kind of falls apart eventually. There we go. Get these. Pop you out. Get in there. Yeah, just don't get involved over there with that spore-filled monster. How about that? Wow, I'm just missing all of these, though. They're not placed where you'd think they would be. All right, let's get here. Hey, buddy. All right, that's the last cage. And whoa, all my squishiness. But it's battle time with Flossil Daisy. Yeah, so I kind of remember you. You are plays where, yeah, okay, and then you run back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. okay, that count as a hit. All right, here you got the looms to guide you to get here. All right, I kind of forgot a lot of the, all right, that's just weird, man. Oh, yeah, you did that, and I just kind of ran right into you. Like, no excuses. But now you're incentivized to keep doing that because uh, as far as you're concerned, like that plant, oh, whoa. All right, all right, right on the butt. Yeah, oh, whoop. Oh, well, then I land on your chin. All right, let's do that again. And like, it stuns you, really? No, please, well, okay, never mind. Uh-huh. I don't know what I thought was gonna happen here. Do the whole row, but whatever, I'll start over with all my health. I went too fast. Not punished. Uh, I... Alright, I'm still alive. Uh, I feel like the game kinda gave that to... Jeez. Okay. Oh, uh, so... Alright. No! Uh, no! Again! I... Yeah. No, 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 no. Well, uh... Can you do a mighty leap? You can tell it's a mighty leap because it takes you a bit. Normal jump, okay. All right. That's the attack I've been waiting for during this whole fight. And when it does happen, I realize that, I don't know if you can actually dodge that, like by reflex. Ugh. Yeah, gearing up for the big jump looks so painful. I got the way it's wincing. Alright. There we go. Right in your tongue, and that's the last hit. 
because it went into cutscene mode. And also, like, you're like real red now. And also, you're so hairy for plant. There are plants with hair, like cattails. Hey, look at that! It's a king of plants. You got like giant teeth. Still carnivorous. Yeah, I don't know why this boss gave me so much trouble. I have no reasons for it. It just did. What can I say? I feel like I was just overestimating it's like how dangerous this was gonna be and that just made me do little silly mistakes i didn't take the boss you no know, like like basically on its own merit and uh, i just kept paying the price I, I was really remembering that quick tongue attack that just makes it funny that when he does use it like i just get completely gotten whoa all right here we whoa see So this is absolutely super mega cleared. There is a giant trophy over it. So the levels here in the real five origin mega trophies on top. Yeah, okay. So okay, so there is a trophy shape on top there, but I guess I guess they're not triggered yet because I have not completed all of the invasions. Yeah, that would make sense. Alright, well we got a new didgeridoo. And we got a new level here for you. Yeah, they're all back, back bobbed. Okay, that's a kitchen level, alright, not to be confused, they look kind of similar. Here we get another monster, that's very different. Really tripping things up here, Morath, the explorer, has been found. I'm gonna get a loom reward of some kind, yeah, it's a thousand of them. What are you gonna do about it, cash it in at a bank? That's right, I guess. Nora Origin, so now we're sitting on three of them, I believe. They're all up there. Don't shoot a DJ. I remember that level name being like, wow, that doesn't have to do with anything. Like, I get the pun you're doing, but it just doesn't relate to nothing. And it's kind of awkward, so... Don't shoot a DJ. Isn't that the last one of World 2? Previous? I'm not sure, but I think we're getting there. Anyways, that's something we can worry about next time. Oh boy, a tiny bread man with three eyes! Uh, and here's a boink man with one eye. So, they had a three eye guy, it was just not placed at the same place. Oh, I wonder if all the variants are like, kind of based on one another. Well, how would you have a three eyed robot? Well, you got one with two eyes, so maybe that's the equivalent when everyone else has a visor. It's the advisory board. Uh, didn't mean anything. I don't know why I said that. Alright, here we go. Do a haha -ha sound as you destroy this precious metal and transform it into a whole bunch of living beings. Are they living? Could be simulating living. 